Hiya, I'm Alex at the Southern Ukulele Store and originally this morning I came in to do a video of the Maestro ukuleles that arrived last week but uh, I held one up against my body and I realised that being left handed I just made them look stupid uh, they've got bevelled armrests and cutaways so I figured we'd do a video on that later on with Phil so a few of you have asked for that but it is coming I promise uh, so in the meantime I thought I'm going to do a video on one of my favourite ukulele brands uh, a brand that not many people have heard of. I think uh, a newer brand and perhaps a name that sometimes uh, doesn't necessarily do them justice, I am talking about the Snail brand of ukuleles. So some of you may have heard of Snail. They make a ukulele starting from about £100, um, kind of laminate sopranos, concert tenors. Uh, and in the last 18 months, they ventured into some kind of more exotic solid wood solid top instruments and quite frankly the first two ukuleles i'll show you in particular have just been one of the most popular ukuleles at any price point that we've had every video review i've done where i've snuck a snail in there if you go back and read through the comments it's a winner uh, not necessarily everybody's winner but certainly one where people go wow i'm really impressed so yeah i thought i'd do a video today on the snail ukuleles i've got a selection of the most popular solid top and solid wood instruments and I'm also going to touch on the SR04C which is this ukulele right here and the tenor version the SR04T okay this first ukulele I'm going to do today this is the SUC M3 this is all solid mahogany uh, ebony fingerboard and bridge uh, the UK street price uh, as of 2018 is about £250, comes with a gig bag, lovely gloss finish as well, see what you think. Second ukulele today is the SUT M3. So this is the tenor version of that last ukulele. Um, yeah, other things to talk about. This ebony fingerboard and bridge is a real bonus at this price point because nine times out of ten now, uh, something like a Carla would have a walnut fingerboard or an Ohana might have an oven coal fingerboard. And if you if you AB them, there's definitely a difference in feel uh, and sound. You do tend to get a little bit more sustain out of the ebony. So yeah, see what you think. Okay, so this second ukulele, this is the BHC5C. This is a brand new model that came out this week, I believe, by Snail. Um, this is around the same price as the SUC M3. I think it's about £10 more. Uh, and for that, you get a solid top. You get laminated Macassette ebony back and sides. Really, really nice, pretty wood. It's got that kind of hot chocolate effect. A uh, slotted headstock, which... Uh, I never really see on a concert. It's a lovely feature. It doesn't weigh too much as well. Some slotted headstocks can make an instrument weigh quite a bit. The tuners feel like a bit of an upgrade as well, uh, in my opinion. And yeah, once again, comes with a bag. I have not, not. I don't tend to notice things like this myself, but if you like your inlays, this flower inlays very nice. See what you think. So this next ukulele is the tenor version 
of the BHC5 series, so the BHC5T. Uh, once again, this has got the solid spruce top, which has a kind of varying shade on the camera, but when you look at it in the flesh, it doesn't exist. Uh, the same kind of mat laminated Macassar ebony back and sides, kind of hot chocolate effect. The slotted headstock, the really nice tuners, and a geek bag. Um, also, I believe it's a real abalone binding on that as well. Uh, but I will make a note here if it's not real abalone. Now on to the fifth ukulele on my list. This is another brand new one that arrived just this week. This is the BHC6C. So this is the solid cedar top version of the model you've just seen previously. Um, it doesn't have the abalone style binding. It has a kind of three tier binding there. It has got a lovely kind of shiny rosette. It's got the same gorgeous little uh, flower inlay there and the slotted headstock. Yeah, you have a look at the back and sides just to give you an example of what to expect. See what you think. God, that is so balanced. That is like, it's like playing a piano. Fantastic. Okay, this lovely ukulele is the tenor equivalent of that previous model. This is the BHC6T. Uh, once again, you've got the kind of three ply binding there with the lovely shiny sound hole rosette, ebony fingerboard and bridge, flower inlay, slotted headstock. See what you think. Okay, and then this penultimate ukulele is the SR04C. This is, I think, one of Snail's kind of flagship models at this point. So this is all solid acacia. It has that kind of fancied armrest that's becoming very, very popular. It seems to be very in fashion right now. So the UK price on this instrument is about 340 as of 2018. So, you know, you're paying just a little bit under the price of a Pono, but uh, for that price you're getting something that is maybe a little bit less kind of deeper sounding, um, and just a bit more mellow, just as refined. I mean, there's no difference in quality here. Oh, I also forgot the scoop there, which is fantastic if you're right-handed and you like to play the drums with your ukulele. Uh, I have to play it this way around, but don't be put off. Normally you would be seeing it played this way around. Okay, and then our final ukulele of the day today is the tenor equivalent of the previous ukulele. This is the SR04T. So this is, once again, solid acacia with the lovely kind of beveled armrest so you don't get that kind of mark and dent on your arm. The scoop, so drums again. And uh, yeah, uh, just a gorgeous ukulele. The ebony fingerboard and bridge, too. I have to play it this way around, don't be deterred.
So, there you go. Which was your favourite? Uh, get in touch if you have any questions. You can always call the shop 01202 430820 or email us at shop at southernukuleleystore.co.uk. Uh, please do. Let me know what you want to see next. Uh, we were going to do the maestro videos today. Hopefully we'll get around to that this afternoon. Uh, in the meantime, there's snail ukuleles. What do you think? <laughs>